today's topic is user experience now what is user experience user experience is an experience of user after using any product or services basically it is emotion like how you feel about any product or services after using it let's take an example of uh, you are traveling with cab there are many cab service provider you tried some new cab and you share do your experience with your friend like another example of restaurant when we visit some new restaurant so we rate our experience about those uh, restaurant like good bad very bad very good extreme good so in this way the feeling the emotion the likes and the dislikes uh, is called experience now it could be either pain either pleasure so in this video i am planning to share some of those example let's start example number 1 cab let's assume that there are two different service provider cab service provider in your area and you usually travel with cab so based on your past experience you rate uh, you share your own rating about those cab service provider based on certain criteria like trusted driver uh limited uh, time availability like they provide uh, they are available all time a fair price uh, would be cheapest from other so there are certain criteria in each and every business so based on those criteria user or customer share their uh, experiences and they decide whether which service provider they have to continue so those criteria create some kind of emotion and feeling and those feeling is called user or customer experience and the role of user experience designer is to trigger a positive emotion like each and every interaction create some emotion which we called either negative emotion either positive emotion let's assume we have two different mobile application for paying electricity bill mobile bill telephone bill insurance premium policy out of one is very uh, simple and easy to use and the reputed and trust trusted brand and easy to understand like you can uh, also pay your monthly bill or electricity bill or mobile bill all those stuffs with one click if payment is already added in their wallet so based on this criteria or this uh, experience user decide whether to continue one of them because in case of mobile application user mostly most commonly user love to use only one application at a time instead of two so user has option to choose any one of them and they are going to choose the best because of experience as compared to b a provide a very good positive emotion and positive experience let's assume there are two different company who sell washing machine company a company b company e a is the uh, company who take care of their customer even after selling their product and company b is the company those who focus on their uh, product selling instead of customer satisfaction so company a when we buy a washing machine in uh, with company a first they uh, their salesman they don't try to sell their product they first understand the need of the customer like how many member are there in your home and uh, what would be the monthly usage of your washing machine and which washing machine would be better for you and in term of second company company like b they focus on incentive like in which uh, washing machine they get a very good incentive so they can so they can sell as per their uh, commission and incentive now again company a they focus on customer satisfaction if even after selling their product like for example we purchased product from a uh, washing machine from company a and we are not able to use that so they say uh, so they send their executives uh, at our home and that particular person is going to show a demo like you have to use this device in this way again when we call a uh, sales executive or customer care team of company b so even they are not going to receive our call and if after trying many time 
if they even receive a call they may not respond properly like the conversation of their customer care executives would be not good or they may not send uh, any person for demo purpose or they may send after a week after 10 days so this is the difference which create emotion after interacting with that particular organization like when we interact when we purchased a product from their brand so they have their brand reputation so based on their brand reputation they treat us like for example we follow and we like to buy a branded products now why branded products why non branded products what is the difference between both of them the difference between both of them is after sale services there is even no guarantee of branded product or no guarantee of uh, or non branded products even they both are almost not almost same but there is a minor difference not huge difference in term of branded and non branded i am not talking about each and every product based on our experience we choose and we recommend the same brand in our family member in our network in our colleagues in our uh, friends so this is called a positive emotion this is called a user experience or customer experience so this is the thing which need to take care and these are the area in which popular brands and big brands and multinational companies they are working and because of customer and user satisfaction they are now <coughs> in available in the market as a big brand now success or failure of any product or services depend on its user or customer experience again the entire game changing of any organization or any product is completely depend on its experience how your customer or user satisfaction level is like for ex- uh, for example i purchase a new sim card and i am facing a network issue and i try to communicate with their customer care executive it is very difficult to reach them and finally when i reached uh, they were not able to solve my network uh, problem uh, after uh, doing lots of follow up also so whenever my friends or my colleague member asked me about a hey, how is your experience with this organization even i would like to uh, buy a same sim card so i am going to recommend and suggest that i had a very bad experience with them so finally i changed my service provider and now right now my network uh, is very good and i am i am able to do a very good conversation on call so this all things are completely depend on experience even if you are not if your product is not good and still your set is user satisfaction or customer satisfaction is very bad still if we are planning to promote our product we are planning to sell our product uh, uh through promotion through lots of investing on advertisement amount it is not going to work for a long time for short term people are going to buy but for long term journey brand reputation may go down and it may ha- harm our brand uh, reputation and goodwill also let's take what is going to happen if in case we are trying to promote our product even if product is not problem solver not product is not a useful product let's assume we have some uh, product or services portal and <coughs> we want those uh, product or services to be shown on the google search engine on front page uh, at the top position so if in case we invest some amount in search engine optimization to make a search engine ranking better still if our product or services is not good <laughs> people may write some uh, negative feedback comments and review about our portal and services and based on those uh, negative comments google is going to make our website down like uh, our our alexa ranking may get reduced or google may have some kind of algorithm which identify the feedback of the customer and based on the feedback of customer and customer satisfaction google understand that this service provider are genuine or fake or how satisfy uh, the customers or user are by them in case of website visiting google has a very strong algorithm called engagement time 
if someone is en uh, able to engage customer for a long time in their uh, website or web portal it means that specific portal content is useful or interesting for user but based on uh, services like whenever user interact with you uh, through your portal or mobile application or uh, direct sale from uh, that particular interaction user feel some kind of emotion like uh, positive feeling or negative feeling based on uh, feeling user share his experience on online portal or with uh, his friend fr friend from the family and uh, colleagues or in social media so google uh, read all those stuffs and identify whether they are genuine or fake so for long term it is important to invest on user experience instead of in investing on uh, a huge amount in search engine optimization thank you for watching this video.